In addiction treatment, it's been a long-standing belief that nicotine um, sort of counteracts some of the negative symptoms that come from psychiatric medicine, psychotropic medication. And so that's been understood that it's okay for people to smoke in psychiatric facilities because it really uh, helps calm them and it makes people um, um, less anxious. And there's been no data to support any of that is true. It's been a belief, a myth, but we've pretty successfully debunked that. Active smoking and the addiction are tend to be um, self-feeding. So when someone is a um, alcoholic that also smokes, we know that if they stop smoking at the time they stop drinking, they're less likely to return to drinking if they discontinue the smoking. Same with methamphetamines, same with opiates. Having strong social connections is a real big asset in, in recovery and in treatment. And what we're trying to do is replace unhealthy social behavior smoking, drinking, methamphetamine use, drug use, with pro-social and healthy behaviors. So what we'll try and do is, is give people more gifts that are healthy and are gonna support their life and support their health and support the quality of life rather than see it as a takeaway.